Samsung is once again preparing to set a new standard in smartphone connectivity with the upcoming Galaxy S26 series. A new listing on the Bluetooth SIG website has revealed an exciting detail, a brand new Samsung chip called the Exynos S6568. This chip is expected to power Bluetooth 6.1 and Wi-Fi features in the Galaxy S26 lineup. Marking one of the biggest leaps in wireless technology for smartphones, the Galaxy S26 series is already rumored to feature the Exynos to 600 chipset in most regions and the Snapdragon 8 Elite Gen 5 in others. But now, this newly spotted Exynos S6568 chip indicates that Samsung adding another layer of advanced hardware. According to the Bluetooth SIG description, this chip is designed to work alongside an Exynos application processor like the Exynos 2600. Its role is to handle Bluetooth and Wi-Fi connectivity, which means Samsung may be separating these tasks from the main processor to improve overall performance. So, what exactly is Bluetooth 6.1 and why does it matter? Bluetooth 6.1 was officially announced by the Bluetooth Special Interest Group, SIG, in May 2025. It's currently the newest and most advanced Bluetooth standard available, offering major improvements over Bluetooth 6.0. The new version promises better security, greater energy efficiency, and faster, more reliable connections. In simpler terms, it allows devices to stay connected for longer while using less power, making it ideal for smartphones, smartwatches, wireless earbuds, and even Internet of Things I devices. Right now, there are no devices on the market that support Bluetooth 6.1 which means the Galaxy S26 could become the first smartphone lineup to introduce this feature. This gives Samsung an edge over competitors like Apple and Google, as users will experience smoother and more stable wireless performance. But how will this new Exynos S6568 chip actually benefit the Galaxy S26? By moving Bluetooth and Wi-Fi functions from the main processor Exynos 2600 to a dedicated connectivity chip, Samsung can optimize how power is used. This setup helps reduce the strain on the main processor, improving battery life, thermal performance, and overall efficiency. It could also lead to better wireless range and faster data transfers, especially when using Wi-Fi or pairing accessories. In short, the S6568 isn't just a small upgrade, it could be a big part of why the Galaxy S26 feels faster, cooler, and longer lasting compared to previous models. The timing of this chip's certification also gives some clues about Samsung's development progress. The Galaxy S26 series is expected to launch in March 2025, though there have been reports of a slight delay due to Samsung reworking the lineup's design and specifications. The certification of the Exynos S6568 now suggests that the phones are in their final testing and approval stages, where every component, from the processor to the camera sensors, gets validated before mass production. This discovery adds to the growing list of upgrades expected for the Galaxy S26 lineup. Reports indicate that Samsung is refining almost every aspect of the upcoming phones, from camera performance and battery optimization to AI-assisted software. Improvements in One UI 8.5, the inclusion of the Exynos S6568 and Bluetooth 6.1 support only, strengthens the case that Samsung is pushing for a more efficient and futuristic user experience. Another interesting point is the impact on connected devices. With Bluetooth 6.1, Galaxy S26 users can expect lower latency and faster communication with wearables, smart home devices, and audio accessories. This means better synchronization with Galaxy Buds, quicker pairing with smart watches, and more stable connections during calls or gaming sessions. Moreover, Bluetooth 6.1's improved security means that connections between devices will be even harder to intercept or tamper with. This is especially useful as users rely more on Bluetooth for digital car keys, payments, and health data as YNCING. It's clear that Samsung's strategy for the Galaxy S26 goes beyond raw power and camera improvements. The company appears to be focusing on smarter connectivity, energy efficiency, and stability, ensuring users get the most out of their flagship devices, while full details about the Exynos S6568 chip are yet to be revealed. One thing is certain, Samsung is investing heavily in advanced wireless technologies to keep the Galaxy S26 lineup ahead of the curve. If these early indications are accurate, the Galaxy S26 could be the first smartphone series to debut Bluetooth 6.1 setting a new benchmark for the industry. As the official launch in March 2025 draws closer, more information about the Exynos as 6568's capabilities will likely emerge. But even at this stage, the leak paints an exciting picture. The Galaxy S26 could deliver not just better performance, 
but a more seamless, secure, and power-efficient connectivity experience than ever before.